The WooPages element allows you to display WooCommerce pages anywhere on your site. Here you can choose to display the card, checkout, my account, and order tracking pages. The My Account page has several sub pages. For example, the login or the lost password pages. If you want to display different elements depending on the sub page, you can use the site source and dynamic conditions. For example, on the login page, I don't want to show the headline My Account. So let's create a specific section for the login page. Let's add a new section, add the WooPages element, choose the My Account page, and now let's choose a condition to only show this section for the login page. Go to the Advanced tab of the section. And under Dynamic Content, select the Site Source. Now under Dynamic Condition, you can choose the sub-page. In our case, it's the Login page. Finally, let's leave the condition is not empty. Now the section will only be shown on the Login page. You can do the same for each sub-page. For example, on the Lost Password page, I have a headline which says Forgot your password. The same can be done for the two subpages of the Checkout page, the Checkout and the Order Received page. And finally, you can also use dynamic conditions to show or hide an element depending on whether it's a guest user or a logged in user. For example, to show a greeting for guest users, set the dynamic condition guest user to is not empty, and for logged in users, set it to is empty.